Hello everybody, Justin Dexley here. Welcome back to part two of the unboxing videos. All right, um, in this one right here, um, well, the first one, rather, the second order that I did was the original Crystal Xbox, uh, original, original Xbox Crystal Edition system, and I bought it on sale for two twenty five, and regular price was two fifty. And I'll show you the picture of it, probably over there. And yeah, this was a pretty nice buy. If you think that was a hefty price to pay for it, it was. The limited edition consoles will definitely be up in price. And that was bought last September. Now, 350 What do you think of that? I am so glad I bought some of the last year because they have <laughs> jumped up in price. All right, this one right here. Um, I don't have the first game because uh, part of the work on a cover was ripped off and I didn't really like that. So after a little while, I took it back and uh, traded it in. But uh, if you do want to see that game, it is Test Drive Unlimited. And on Patreon, in my uh, part one video of uh, the uh, unboxings, part one, part two, part three, and part one, I did have the game back then in that video. So if you want to see that game, then uh, head on over there. The other two games I have right here, because so these ones are good, and I'm not so, taking them away. So this game right here, um, there's a bit of a story with this and Test Drive Unlimited. Um, if you're on Patreon and you watch that video there, then I do explain the story behind these two games. So I'm not going to get into it here. If you want to find out the story, then head on over there. But yeah, this is Grand Theft Auto 4 Complete Edition. With the episode from Liberty City as well. So I think that's uh, pretty cool. Original cover art as well. It's a little holographic. Um, there's, uh, you can feel the letters and stuff like that. So it's very nice. It wasn't complete when I got the system though. I mean, the game. There was not, nothing in uh, just the two discs because there's the game disc and then the episode from Liberty City there. Yes. But the manual, the map, two-sided poster, and a GTA 5 flyer were not in here. So when I took the two games, that this and Text Drive Unlimited back to the store, I got them straightened out and put in better cases because the cases they came in were broken. And got this one complete. So, there's that. This one was 20 bucks. I think it was Sarah, but it might not have been. I don't know. Um, the other one, Test Drive Unlimited, was 15. And uh, the next game is 15, but I also got a $15 discount. So, I got... I like to say this game here, I got for free because the other one I paid for a 15. This was also 15, but since I had the same $15 off, I made this one be free. So, yeah. And as you would guess, Burnout 3 for the original Xbox. Yep. Burnout 3 for the Xbox. On Patreon, I have this fully played through, 100% walkthrough on Patreon in three parts. So, if you're interested in that, head on over there. Link, in, link to pa Patreon is in the description below. And yeah, uh, yeah. That was a lot of fun playing through. Getting everything for the first time. Because I had the game on the PS2 for many years. And I have never gotten 100%. But on the original Xbox, yeah. I just got everything. So yeah, that was fun. And yeah, uh, next one is... Ooh, this one's an uh, interesting list. Um, strategy guides. I have been collecting strategy guides. 
the first one that I got, I got like uh, eight or something here. Um, the first one I got, Mario Party 5. Yes, this one is awesome. It's a party, it's party time, Mario style. Yeah. Pretty much officially, the official strategy guide. All 75 minigames covered. There's quite a bit in the tips, tricks, strategies, and treats for all 75 minigames. All hidden game secrets revealed. Crucial details on all capsules in the game, items. Every game mode covered in detail, full color, 3D maps of all the board maps with every happening space explained. Every super dual machine part revealed, including the super rare um, Bowser Punch and bob -omb Wall. So, everything is covered in the strategy guide, and this was the last one. All the strategy guides I got were the last ones available in the store, even if they were the only copies available. So, yeah. This one was 25 bucks, so I think that was a pretty nice price for that. Next one up, you guys know this game well. Uh, I have done I have done a playthrough on my channel with face cam to this mini game or uh, through this game, and I will be redoing the game on Patreon with uh, better quality and better audio quality and stuff like that. So it's gonna be redone sometime in the near future. Wayman Raven Roberts TV Party. And it does uh, have the Wii balance board as an option, but I don't have the balance board, but I think I will uh, acquire it at some point, but I don't know if I would uh, use it in the playthrough. If I, if I do, then la la la, but I don't know. This one was 10 bucks. Uh, I think all of these are complete. The only one that I didn't get complete was Outlaw Golf for the GameCube, but I traded that in at a different store and got the original Xbox version, which came complete. Ooh, this next one? Ooh, this is interesting. This is another Game Boy Advance game. Uh, before we get to that, there's this. Got the uh, PlayStation 1 system right here. The co controller, which has the analog sticks. So it's not the very original one, but uh, it's uh, the PS2 version of the PS1 controller. Got a Hyperkin memory card right there. So I got that because I didn't have a PS1 memory card here at home. So I got one. This was, this came new for 10 bucks in the case, but uh, I took it out because I needed to use it. And then there's the system itself. The original Fat PS1. Yep. I wanted this over the Slim because uh, I do prefer the original of the original and I think this looks better even though it's bigger, thicker. But I, uh, out of this and the slim, I prefer this. Also the price, the price of this crop. I got that on sale for $49.50 last year. The price for that now, 130 yeah, I ain't paying that for that. <laughs> oh, right, what's next? Um, yeah, the Game Boy Advance again. So let's get that out. All right, next one up. Come on. All right, so this one here is Crash Bandicoot Purple. Ripto's Rampage. A minus condition. Complete with manual and precaution booklet. Um, the box is uh, in a little, little worse shape. The Mario Party Advance box is the best condition box that I have right now. 
this one is a little little bit down but still okay all right so i got the precautions and the manual right here and the game and yeah the uh i got this for 40 bucks yep 40 bucks i don't know if it was the sale price it might have been but uh, at the time i got it for 40 complete with a minus condition right now there's one available with no manual for 60 bucks yeah why I feel like anyone who gets that is being whipped off because I got this one complete with a better looking case for m less money. And this one is a B or C or whatever condition box. So yeah, that's screwed up. All right, next one up, Prince of Persia, The Sands of Time. I don't believe I played this game before. I've seen it in action, and I might have played a little bit of this, but that was at a, a former friend's place a long time ago. So, but I've never played it um, on my own at home. Uh, I have the game, I had this for a while, and I still haven't played it yet. Because uh, I don't know if I should play this on the original Xbox or if I should get the HD remaster that's on the PlayStation 3. But I haven't found one on available yet. So, yeah, there's that. It's, uh, I showed you the inside, right? Yeah. This one was 5 bucks. Sale price, I believe. I don't know. It was uh, pretty interesting. Uh, the case that it came in had a broken piece on top here. So I had to replace the case. The next game is Project Gotham Racing 2. And yes, this is in a black case. I don't have as many of the original Xbox screen cases, so once I get more of them, then I'll up this and Project Gotham Racing 1, which I also got in the green cases. But right now, they're in the black cases, so complete. Got the extra stuff behind the manual as well, so pretty nice. This was also, this was 250, 50% 50 off. <laughs> so that was uh, pretty interesting. All right, next one up, also 250. Nope, the next one is Forza Motorsport. Original for 375 on Xbox, but it didn't have a manual, so I eventually traded it in. This next one I still have because it came complete, and it's also 250. Gran Turismo 3 Ace Bet. However, this is not the original blue cover that you would get with the game. This is um, the red is. The red is from the, this is the not for sale uh, version. And this came from a PlayStation 2 GT3 racing pack that was uh, available a long ass time ago. And it might be available on uh, eBay for a hefty price, but yeah, this is basically where it came from. And I would probably have a picture somewhere. So. There you go. Found that uh, weird how they gave me that instead of the original blue cover and stuff like that. Which, it, it's fine. I, I like red, so I have no problem with that. Um, that's it for um, this one. So, total came to 150 with the $15 discount. 